Hi! In this video, we're going to learn how to set up Particle Workbench and flash your first piece of code to your Particle device. For this tutorial, you'll need a computer, a Particle device, and a USB cable connecting the device to the computer. Alright, let's get started! First, you need to install Workbench. There are two ways to do this. If you already have VS Code installed, just go to the extensions page and search for Particle Workbench. Then press install. If you don't have VS Code installed already, Go to particle.io slash workbench, then click install. Select the system you're using, for me that's Mac, then follow along with the installer's instructions. If you run into any issues installing Workbench, check out the troubleshooting doc linked in the description. Once you've installed Workbench, you should see this nice welcome screen. There's a lot of handy information here. Make sure to log into your Particle account, and there's also a toolbar over here on the left with frequently used features. If you ever need to go back to the welcome screen, click this particle logo in this left toolbar. Now you're ready to get started with some code. To test this out, we're going to have the device's onboard light blink. First, click on create a new project or use the command palette to create a new project with the command particle create new project. You'll notice that there are two functions already created in the file. Void setup and void loop are mandatory functions that must exist in the code. Setup runs at the beginning of the code execution, and after that, loop loop de loops constantly. In the top right of the program, uh, you'll also notice that there are six icons from left to right. They are compile, flash, call function, read variable, subscribe to an event, and launch CLI. So at the top of your file, name your light and set it to pin D7, which is the onboard light. In setup, declare the light to be an output. In loop, make the light turn on by digital writing the light to high and having it delay for 1000 milliseconds before digital writing the light to low. Configure the project for your device. From the command palette, select Particle Configure Workspace for Device. Select the device OS you're using. Then select the device type. I'm using an Argon. Now choose your device from the list of devices. Mine is called Argonaut. For any of this to work, we need to send the device our code. This is called flashing the code. First compile it here. Next click the lightning bolt to flash the code to your device. After you flash the code, it should cycle through all of the different colors in the status light, and then the little D7 light should start blinking. If it doesn't start blinking, make sure that all of the code is written as it was here, and double check that you're pushing to the right device. If you still have issues, visit community.particle.io and post about it. Happy hacking! Thank you!